Welcome back. Our next guest here, Samson Levingston, is a lover of Indiana history. And he's actually earning national attention for his walk and talk tours throughout the city. Great job. Yeah, he's the founder of the organization Through Two Eyes and is here to tell us more about what you can learn on one of his tours around our beautiful city. Samson, welcome to the show. Samson. I'm so happy to be on Indy now, right now. We're having I've been waiting, I've been waiting for it. Yes, you got the you. city edition Come journey. on, we'll, talk, we'll get to talking about oh, it. Don't yes. worry. Like, but yes, <laughs> you know, I, I'm excited to talk about history, yeah. even right now, talk about what happened in the past. And so all I've been doing since June of 2020 is trying to educate as many people that come to Indianapolis about our rich and beautiful history. Mm. And for me, it starts like on Indiana Avenue with our beautiful black history. And yeah. then we expand on that. Our history is so diverse. So many different people from different places have made Indianapolis home and continue to. That is cool to remind us of all the like great traits that we bring together historically to make Indy what it is now. Man, that's an yeah. awesome mission. I, I can already just feel your passion. I know. Yes, I, yes, I, know. I love it. I love it. It's great. So I know that you go, you do the walking and talking when the weather's a little bit yeah. nicer out. What do you do during the winter? Great question. I'm so glad you asked. So we do these walk and talk workshops where we go to different companies and we present this stuff. We talk about green books and how people used to travel across the country. We talk about the ways that redlining has impacted our city. We also celebrate our great champions like uh, the Christmas Addicts Tigers, 1955 state champions, Jesus. right? Special edition. So like we get people <laughs> excited about like Indianapolis history. Yeah. So, and we even go to schools, present the same stuff in what I call a hawk and talk. Where we yeah. talk about Indiana nature and Indiana history. Get a the, kid, get the kids involved, you know? <laughs> Love that. So yeah, so that's what I'm doing when it's not, you know, like 75 and sunny in the great city of that's Indianapolis. So cool. Keep it busy. Yes, sir, yeah. yes, sir. How did this even start? Because I, like we said, we can see the passion. Yeah, have yeah. For well, like when 2020 happened, we were all kind of stuck in the house, cooped up, and like we got to see what our real hobbies were. Like, what yeah. are your, what are your real hobbies? Like, yeah. what do you like? And of course, for me, like it was history. And so the more yeah. I kept diving into that and using it as a teaching tool with everything that was going on, like the more I realized that Indy not only wanted something like this, but kind of needed something like this. And so mm. it's cool to, to put that passion into what I love to do. When, now, when someone's on one of these walk and talk yeah. tours, do you find that everyone is a Hoosier? Um, I think so, and I try to okay. bring as many people in as yeah. I can. So we get people from all across the world, which yeah. is cool, but there's always a connection to Indianapolis. I had a group from Brazil, they're excited about Helio Castroneves winning the Indianapolis 500. Sure. Yeah. And then of course, like in next month, all eyes on Indianapolis for right. All Star Weekend. All, all Star eyes weekend. on, this is a special edition, city edition. This yeah. one actually has my name on the back. Hey, just, so, just so y'all know, I'm really ready to be an, I was an yes. all-star before the game We should have worn ours. We have jerseys we just like that so, with our yeah. names. So I'm talking about, we didn't get the memo. This, no, I didn't know. I didn't tell you. I didn't, it was a surprise, <laughs> surprise. So yeah, history keeps us on our toes, yeah. right? Yeah. Whether that's old basketball or new ball. Yeah, I know, it's cool. so great to have events like that in our city. Yes. And then to look back at all the events mm -hmm. that have shaped our city into what it is today. Right, so like we had the all-star game in Indianapolis in 1985 at the Hoosier Dome. Yeah. Right. Yeah. People forget about yeah. this. Like we, We've kind of done this before. So to like remind them, but also put this new flair, this new spin yeah. Yeah. on Indianapolis while honoring our rich history. Like, look at this table. Can we not talk about our history? But also, we got a lot going on that weekend too. So I just want to get people excited about MLK Day, Black yeah. History Month, right. All Star Weekend. Like, it's all coming up. You know, well, let's talk how about can it. People find you and get on one of these workshops or tours. Right? Yeah. So my website through two eyes.com. But really, if you Google Walk and Talk Indianapolis, you'll see some stuff and just like shoot us an email. We take companies all the time. It's great for like outings, workshops. We go to yeah. retirement homes, things like that. So like whatever, just find us on it. Find us on the Internet. We're out there, you yeah. know, and then uh, We'll get back with you and we can't wait to see you. Well, your enthusiasm you. is contagious. Yeah, it's it's so, 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 yeah, yeah, I, yeah no, I'm at, no, I, I try to just match you guys, really. Yeah. I was watching well, you are before. so much fun. We have all the information right there on the screen if you want to check out the tours, the workshops, everything Samson has going on. Thank you so much for being yeah. here. Thank you. I appreciate Thank you. you. Yeah, yes. this Perfect is great. for the history lover in your family. Thank you, Samson. Yes. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Coming up, we're going to introduce you to the founder of Girl Talk Inc. and find out how the young women in your world can join their next eight week empowerment program. Yeah, coming up this month. Plus, we're going to tell you today's theme for Lyrical Lightning, our Name That Tune game when we come back right after this. Stick around, guys. Great job.